So if you're coming to Uscreen and you already have an existing website, you might really be happy with how it's set up. You like the menu, you like how things link, and you don't actually want to use the Uscreen homepage. So what we're going to do here is we're going to show you how to hide the homepage and make it so that any links that would typically go to the homepage will actually go to your original website that might be hosted on Wix or Squarespace or something like that. So one of the first things we need to do, we need to open our storefront here just so I can show you kind of what we're dealing with here. I'm going to sign out and then just kind of re-navigate to the catalog. So your original website, you should send any users that click, let's say, a catalog in the menu here to the Uscreen catalog. And we need to actually make it so this link, this uh, this logo here does not link to the homepage. That's one step that we need to fix. Also, when a user is signed in and they actually sign out here, it will attempt to send them to the homepage. So we need to change how that redirects. And then lastly, um, this is kind of on your end in, in your other uh, website hosting software here. You're going to want to try to match um, the use screen kind of navigation to the, to the navigation that's in that other software. And so you can kind of do it two ways. You can adjust the use screen side or you can adjust your other software as well. But this is so that when users are clicking around on your original website and they click, let's say the browse button and it takes them to the use screen catalog, it's not a huge change in the menu here. If things look way different, um, it can kind of affect how people choose to go ahead. It might, they, we don't want it to look like a totally different website. Uh, when they're navigating between the two platforms. So let's go back here and we're going to go to customization. And before you do any customization, just make sure you do a backup because uh, we're going to edit the code and there's no undo buttons there. Once you save it, it is live. And if you don't remember what you've changed, you need to restore it. The way you would do that is through a backup that you've created. So first let's go to um, the navigation and we're going to change it. So this home button does not appear. And click on navigation. We'll go to the main menu here. And there's two kind of ways you can do this. You could delete this completely. Or if you do have a home button on your original website, uh, we're just going to change this custom link. And then we would type in the URL of the, the website you actually want to send it to, not the Uscreen storefront. So there's that one. And then we also want to change where the logo goes. And we're going to go to advanced and then code editor. And we need to go to this top menu here. And what we need to do here, this a tag, it's like the fourth line down. It might be a little different depending on the theme you have. Um, but we just need to change what's between these quotes. We need to type in the URL of this other website, the same one that we did for that home menu item. So you would type that in and then save your changes there. Now, lastly, we need to go to the index.liquid page. This is your main homepage and we're actually going to delete all of this code. And I have some code here we're going to insert, and I will include this in the video description. So go ahead and grab it down there. But this is a redirect code that whatever URL I type in between these quotes, that's where um, when someone signs out, instead of going to the home page, it's going to redirect them to a different page. So basically, anytime the home page is, is someone tries to access it directly, it'll redirect them. So it's not possible to actually view it. So I put in Google here and this will just allow us to test, but let's go to my storefront. We're going to sign in and then we'll sign out and we'll be on Google. So we skip that home page, We go right to Google there. So that, well, if I click too far, okay. So that should do it for everything that fixed our logo, the home button that only appears when you are signed out. Um, and then also the sign out redirect as well. And that should do it for you.